Hey guys, it's Nikki. I'm back with another video and I know it's been a while and I'm really sorry because I have been wanting to film for a while but I just haven't and now I'm here. So let's just get into this fall favorites video. Okay, so for fashion favorites, the first thing I'm going to talk about is shoes and my first pair are these from American Eagle and I actually got these Black Friday shopping last year but they are super super soft and they're super comfortable and easy to just throw on when you need to go outside or go to the mall or something and they're super cute too. I just love these a lot and they're awesome. I've been wearing them like crazy this week and I just had to add them in are these gorgeous boots that are they're not they go up to almost your knee so I guess you would call them knee-high boots I don't know but I just love them they're adorable and they're I don't know what else to say about them they're just so cute I love them like a ton hats and one of my big favorites is this one, which this one fits really cute and I really like the style of it. Now I have two hat favorites that I have been loving and I'm actually sponsoring their company. Um, and this video isn't sponsored by them, but I do like take pictures with their hats and stuff on Instagram and post them and tell people to check it out. So. Yeah, but they're not sponsoring this video. Um, I just wanted to talk about them. And it's City Hunter Cap Apparel USA. And their hats are super cute. This one I think is more like summery, fall-like. But I this one's my favorite. This is the one I picked out. And then I thought this one would be cool for fall because it has that like orange to it that's just super cute for fall and so I thought it would be cool to show you guys these and they're really awesome Woo! okay that fell off the bed all right my next favorite is this chunky cardigan which it's really hot in here right now so it's not exactly something I want to be wearing right now but it's adorable and I love it so what's new my next favorite are chunky cardigan oh, chun I can't talk chunky sweaters and you guys have seen this one tons before but this American Eagle one is my absolute favorite and I just had to show you guys this one but I also recently got a new sweater and it's from forever 21 and it's just the most adorable thing ever and I really love it and this pattern is just like so cool at first I was like I don't know how I feel about this but then once I got it and put it on I was like oh my gosh this is perfect it's adorable so I'm really happy I got it The next thing I've been loving is long t-shirts, which I'm actually wearing one right now, but this one and the one I'm wearing are both from Cotton On, and they're just super duper long. So they're really awesome, and I love to wear them with yoga pants, which is one of my other favorites, but all of my yoga pants are dirty right now because I've been wearing them all weekend. Yeah. So my last fashion favorite is knee-high socks, which I'm wearing some of right now, which you probably can't see, but it's okay. I have a ton of them, and I just love them a lot. So first, we're going to start off with beauty favorites, and my first beauty favorite is this professional, and I talk about this a lot in most of my makeup videos, but this is like honestly one of my favorite things and I love it so if you haven't tried it you definitely should. My next beauty favorite is 
the Maybelline The Colossal Volume Express, which I kind of like whenever I get mascaras, I'll like use it and then I'll stop using it for a while and then go back to it and that's what I've done with this one and I came back to it a lot because this one has a really nice effect on your lashes and I just really like it. My next two favorites are eyeliners actually and the first eyeliner is this Lorac Front of the Line Pro and I've been using this for a while so you guys have probably heard this. I've only used like three liquid liners that I've really liked and this one is one of my absolute favorites. And then my next one is this Silk Seam uh, by L'Oreal Paris and this one is just super pretty and it, I think it makes my eyes look kind of bigger. And I just put it over my eyeliner, like above it, and uh, I actually did, I used this in my Halloween makeup tutorial, so if you want to check that out, you should go do that. Because the makeup looks on my Halloween makeup tutorials, and you could use those just for everyday looks too, um, I do. Next beauty product has to do with eyebrows. and. I have been using this Ellen Tracy brow pencil and the brow stencil and this thing helps like a lot with doing my brows and it came with three stencils but number one is my stencil and th this just came in a set and it came with two other things like um, it came with some brow shadow and a brow gel but I don't use either of those but I have been really liking these. Next thing is eyeshadow palettes and the first one you guys have probably seen before and it is the L'Oreal LA Palette Nude 2 palette and this is what it looks like. It's really pretty and nudes, that's what it is. And then this one, I have actually been using this as like a contour kit because my contour kit is like this big and it's hard to travel with. So I've been using the adorable NYX eyeshadow palette and it just has a lot of pretty colors and I use it as eyeshadow too, but I mostly use it for contouring. I have one last beauty product and that is the All My Makeup Remover Wipes and these have, um, these have aloe, cucumber, and green tea in it and they smell really good and they take off my makeup very well and they're uh, pure hypoallergenic and they don't break out my face and this is the only brand I've found that doesn't break my face out more. So. I really like this and if you have a face that breaks out easy, I would recommend this big time. That was my last beauty favorite. Now on to apps. I have two apps that are some of my favorites and one of them is Retail Me Not and I just thought I would share it with you since Black Friday and Mayhem Monday are coming soon. and. Pretty much what this is, is you can just go on it and you can find different coupons for different stores. You just favorite the stores that are your favorites and then you can use them in store and online depending on what they say. Sometimes they're just for in store, sometimes for, they're just for online, and sometimes they have both. So it's really awesome and I really love this app. So I think you guys should check it out if you haven't already. The second app I've been loving this month is The Hunt and if you want to you guys can follow me on it. It's Nikki DIY and I just post uh, some things that I've been wanting to find and you guys find them for me and I just really like this app and I know a lot of YouTubers talk about it but I really do love it just like everyone else who says it. 
So if you haven't downloaded that, you should. The next thing I'm going to be talking about is music. And I have had a lot of music favorites during fall. I have a lot of music favorites, period. But this fall, there has been a lot of new music and I just really like a lot of it. Some of my favorite artists have been Hazley. I love her album and I love Selena Gomez's new album and Demi Lovato's new album. If you haven't heard those, you definitely should. And also, Justin Bieber, his three new songs that came out are amazing. And also, if you didn't know, his album is coming out this Friday on the 14th and I'm super excited about it. You don't even know how excited I am. And yeah, so I can't wait for that. And then I have three just random songs that are my favorites right now. And that's Magnets by Disclosure Feet Lord. And also Hello by Adele and Focus by Ariana Grande. And those are just three random songs that are my favorites. And then the rest of them are just artists because I love all of their songs. So, yeah. My candle favorite of the month, actually this is always my favorite during this time of year because it's just an amazing candle. It is this marshmallow fireside candle, which I'm not gonna pick it up because I'm afraid I'm gonna drop it and set everything on fire and I don't wanna do that, so. Yeah. And then I just have some random favorites and one of my random favorites is white roses, which yes, these are dead, but they're still pretty and I love them and you can just keep roses afterwards, so they're really awesome. And I put them in this Voss bottle, so, ooh, looks so pretty. And I just really love white roses. I don't know what it is about them. I just really like them. And my next random favorite is my new tapestry, which looks like this. I can't hold it up all the way obviously because it's huge and I get a lot of comments about my other tapestry that I have and that one is from Etsy I got that one I think last year for $25 and then I just got this one on Amazon and it, this one was only $10 it's 13 now but I got it when it was on ten for $10 and I thought that was awesome so if you are looking for a tapestry that's where I got mine. One of my other random favorites is my hair. I dyed it just for the season. I wanted it to still be ombre, but now that it's not, I actually kind of like it. And it's really cool. I miss having brown hair sometimes, and I'm actually happy I went back to it. Um, a lot of people asked me, why is my hair not ombre anymore? And it's because I wanted it to go dark for the season. And my last favorite, I'm going to try to hold up. Ugh. Drop. Yep, that drop. It's this tray that I have that I just set on my desk. And it's super cute. You guys have probably seen pictures of it. It, I have a piece of wood on it and I just stick random stuff on it. And it's really cute. I love it. It just adds a lot of decoration to your room, I think. I, I don't know. I just haven't really got too much jewelry. But it's this crystal necklace and I think it is gorgeous and it's really long so I love to layer it with stuff. It just looks really nice and I got it from Forever 21 if you're wondering. Um, it was actually really cheap, it was like $6. And now we'll go into nail favorites, which I have a few. Um, they're all three by Essie. And it's this one, which is Penny Talk. This one called Good as Gold. And this red that is called Wrapped in Rubies. And I really like these as just the colors. They're just gorgeous colors. And I got these like last year, but, and I've used them like throughout the year and stuff. But this is my favorite time to use like golds and reds. And 
I need to paint my nails today because they look ratchet. But let's not talk about that. And then one of my favorite coats to put on top is a matte top coat, which I've probably talked about this before, but I really like matte top coats because it makes your nail polish look like textured and it's really cool looking. I like to use it more on like black, but I use it on a lot of different colors. Black's just one of my favorite ones to use it on. And yeah, that's all the nail face. Hey guys, it's Nikki. So I really hope you guys liked this video. It was really fun to film and I say that about a lot of videos, but I hope you guys like my fall favorites. These are just all of my favorites right now. And I just thought I would share. Um, and also, I think I'm gonna start making these seasonal where I just make one like during fall, winter, summer, spring, so then I'm not making them every month because I used to make them every month, but then I kind of stopped. And now I'm thinking about doing them seasonally. And tell me by thumbsing up this video if you wanna see more of these seasonal ones. So. I will see you guys next time and I love you all so much and if you want to become a part of the family you should definitely do that and subscribe to this channel because that would be awesome and um, you guys should check out all of my links below that have my Instagram and Twitter and Tumblr and all those fun entertaining things and give this video a thumbs up and check out my recent videos if you haven't already and i will see you guys next time bye